Printing business is a very lucrative business. But the moment you make your first mistake, you are discouraged because it is capital intensive. And this is why you need education. And that's why we've come up with this program to see if we can educate the public. Today's episode is going to be looking at how to start up a printing business. Printing business is like any other business. You need a plan to start up. But I'm going to take you through a trajectory of a few stages that a startup printing business will go through. Before we start talking about the stages, you need to realize that you need someone who has been there to take you there when it comes to printing. I always say printing is very, very technical. So you need to consult. You need to ask the right questions. And you need people who have been there to take you to that position. The first stage I want to talk about is the launch phase. Launch means at that point you need to decide what form of printing you want to go into. Do you want to go into book printing? Do you want to go into offset printing? Do you want to go into textile printing? Or do you want to print on substance, flat substance, uh, signage for instance, or you want to print on flex? You can print on almost anything, but you need to decide what kind of printing you want to go into. Remember that in this launch phase, don't expect sales. A lot of people go into business and they feel that immediately they start the business, well, that's when they will start making money. Make your projections for the first six months to one year. And plan it in such a way that, okay, if I don't make a cover in this period, can I still continue because consistency is key. We must ensure that whatever you get, whatever sector you get into, you must ensure that quality jobs come out at the end of the day and you must keep at your consistency to make sure your quality control is intact. The second stage is the growth stage. At this point, you are expected to start making money. And if I'm going to use a case study, a customer called in to say, I want to start something. And in his launch stage, we had lots of discussion. And that discussion zeroed him into starting something that is not already popular, because he wants to break into a totally different market. He's got clientele that are fashion people. He's got clientele that are brand owners. And so we advised him to start up with a direct to garment printing machine. So he starts up at the launch stage with a direct garment printing machine. But in the first one year, he's making samples, he's building confidence in the market because no one trusts direct garment printing. It's something new, it's something different. So in the launch stage, he might not necessarily be making money. But immediately he goes to the growth stage. Customers start believing in him. So two customers will walk in today, four customers will walk in tomorrow, and next tomorrow, six customers will walk in. And at the end of the day, we begin to see growth. So at the point where you begin to see growth, means sales is beginning to increase. And at this point, you need manpower that is well-trained to man the setup. So your manpower training is extremely important. Everyone must know what their job entails. Everyone must be professional enough to keep ensuring that the jobs that are going out are quality. Everyone must be trained with an eye to see quality, to see problems. So that immediately there is a problem you can stop. And every job going out in your growth stage must be jobs that are technically acceptable. And after the growth stage is what I have called the shake out phase. So in this phase, you're going to decide if you will remain in the market or not. Because believe me, in Nigeria, it's our culture to copy businesses. So the moment you enter the growth stage and your printing business starts growing, you will begin to have competition. So one guy will set up next door to you, another guy will set up opposite you. And at this point in time, what do you need? You need a lot of creativity. Number four stage is the stage of maturity. And in maturity, that means that your sales is growing, but then 
you are now begin to reduce your profit margin. And the reason you are reducing your profit margin is that there are more competition. The market is becoming tighter. And if you are not careful in the maturity stage, you will enter the stage five, which is decline. And I won't talk about that because I don't want any business declining. So in the maturity stage, it's a time when you need to recreate, you need to reinvent, you need to relaunch, and then you can go through the four other phases again. Printing is vast, so don't ever try to go alone. If you want to print money, you need to do it right. And if you need to do it right, you need to talk to the experts. So if you need any advice, you can always contact us before starting up your print business. Thank you very much for your time.